So I've been re-watching One Punch Man. Awesome series, I know. Anyways, do you guys remember that part where Genos asked him to train? So this whole scene started to give me an idea. And it's kind of a badass one. But first, I started building a list of just random goals that I want to accomplish in my field of work. Call it my personal technology bucket list. And as I was writing this list down, I started realizing that I had worked with so many different technologies. However, the one thing that stood out to me was the fact that on this quest to challenge myself with new tech, I'm going to need a place to continue expanding my knowledge. A place that's, that's really my own. And I don't have to worry about breaking things or being restricted by what I can and can't do, you know? Like while I'm at work, or even if I'm collaborating on a project, I really don't want to break stuff there. And I want to be able to run crazy test scenarios, or even figure out when things would break. Perhaps even better, seeing how they would break. All of this is with the goal of seeing software functionality and strategize to prevent issues, or to at least understand how to alert before something becomes catastrophic. I'm gonna need a place where I could be more objective about my approach to things I want to learn and I'll always keep my skills to the fringe of my abilities. So this is going to be ground zero. I decided I wanted to build a lab, and not just any lab. Consider it my personal dojo, where I can train and continue to perfect my craft. After giving it some thought, I'm gonna do it like a Bowflex commercial, but instead of the 20 minutes a day, three times a week, I'm gonna start with one hour a day, three times a week, and build up from there. Since the goal of this challenge was to expand my mind and further educate myself, I want to throw myself to the hazard and remain outside of my comfort zone. So let's double dare this and go for the physical challenge and beast this thing.